At first, this river was considered a creek. This uncharted and unnamed river is classified as a creek in official government records. Who would think that this creek would be full of species that would mark our interests? Welcome! This is the Tungtung River Conservation Project, also known as TRCP. The Tungtung River is perennial. Its spring-fed headwaters are located in and around the Beverly Hills subdivision in the boundary of Antipolo and Taitai Rizal. The river stretches for 15 kilometers and eventually connects to the Pasig River via the Mangahan Floodway. The river's source is within a 15-minute hike from a non-stop, non-for-profit private school known as the Holistic Education and Development Center, or HEDSEN. We, the students of HEDSEN, have decided to adopt the river as a field laboratory for our environmental science classes. And so, the Tungtung River Conservation Project, or TRCP, was born last 2007. We seek to study the river from its basic hydrology to its flora and fauna. We are compiling a biodiversity database consisting of bird species and butterflies and moths. We are conducting surveys in nearby Antipolo City to determine if food establishments have practices that negatively impact the river in particular and the environment in general. We put up a website to serve as a platform from which the Tungtung River Conservation Project may be better known, better appreciated, and ultimately, for the Tungtung River to be better protected. Because the water is still clean, species within the area of the river can benefit from it. Cows, for instance, can drink water that comes from it. But despite the water being clean, Illegal settlers and other houses that are located near the area are contributing to the polluted state of the river. They do their laundry on the banks, or worse, they dispose their waste in the already filthy waters. This has led to some parts of the river being contaminated, full of trash. Big responsibilities cannot be shouldered if you cannot even handle small ones. How can we deal with bigger problems if we can't solve smaller ones? How can we even begin to dream of restoring the Pasig River if we can't even take care of our own backyard streams? Let us preserve the Tungtung River before it is too late. With willing students and faculty mentors, we are sure that our dream of restoring and conserving the Tungtung River as part of our natural heritage will someday come true. It can happen. It will happen.